Hi, we're in the next part, next segment of Villa of St. Patrick's Day Special oh, Segment Number Two, which is we're going to play Are You Smart for the Fifth Grader for the Week? Shut up, man! You won't. I hope I get some guesses soon. Cause I got some <laughs> trouble on these questions. <laughs> and I mean it you, seriously. You, you, and you, and you. <sighs> Yo, don't do, don't say that. Come on, can't be time. No, that's, that's not cool. Team, you <laughs> Yo, Alex is mar Alex is marvelous, so I'm inviting you. Oh. No. Bernie, help. Hi, I'm Jeff Foxworthy, and welcome to Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? Got him. You know what? Well, I mean, what the hell? What you mean with the heck? Oh, come on. I'll call you. You can't me on that. I always catch you. For me. Scamp it. Come on, Daniel. Daniel, hurry up. Alright, run back. Well, well done. Yes. Oh, okay. I'll do that. Uh, accessories. Glasses. This guy was blind. Maybe. Get it, Dre. Airy. Why you need Airy for? I'm a fan of Dragon Ball. A bow. A hat. My favorite, my favorite play is Vegeta. Hello. I'm going to you show. Number four. <laughs> You're smarter than a fifth grader. Come it's on, that man. easy. Let's meet your classmates. Jed. Awesome. Paul. Cool. Justin. Yeah. Kara. Woohoo. And Melissa. Let's go. Okay, let's get our player out here. He's a new improved hunter. I'm very excited to be here. He's a new improved. All right, now I'll tell you how to play the game. Up on the board. Oh no! Seconds. Questions range from oh, first no. grade through the fifth grade. Not Your these first ones. correct answer is worth one thousand dollars. If you get the tenth question correct, it is worth five hundred thousand dollars. If you do answer all two questions yet. correctly, we give you an opportunity to answer an additional grade school question. And if you get it right, you'll Daniel, win oh my God, one million dollars. Fucking Remember, bullshit. if at any point the pressure gets to be too high, you can take the yeah. money that you bankrolled up to that point hey, Daniel, and kill that one. drop out of our little school. Let me remind you of your cheats. During the course of the game, you have two cheats. You can peek at your classmates' paper only once during Damn. the game, and if you like their answer, you can use it. If you don't, you can go with your own. 
You may also copy your classmates' paper only one time per game, but you have to take the answer they have written down. Oh, or if you, think you know the answer, that. once during the game you can use a save. That means if you answer incorrectly, no. but your classmate at the podium has the right answer, they can save you. You can only use each cheat once, and when they're gone, you won't be able to get any help from your classmates for the rest of the game, so use them wisely. All right, that'd be... You can drop out of school at any time and take whatever money you've earned. But before you can walk away with a loot, you have to tell the whole world that you are not smarter than a fifth grader. Is it a deal? Absolutely. Then let's get going. Pick a classmate and let's get started. Oh, I'm going to pick Justin. Yeah! Here we go. Let's see the list of subjects for this game. Animal science, earth science, measurements, math, reading, art, English, music, astronomy, social studies. All right, let's find out. Are you smarter yeah, than a fifth grader? Pick a subject. Um, let's go with earth science. Okay, the $1,000 question is... People live the same way, no matter what climate they live. Your classmate is locked in. Ooh, it's a copter. Locking in. It's time to take a Maybe. Maybe. There you go. You're locked in. I will going to say no, but... You're 14, come on. That's not... Oh! Ah! Oh, no. What the heck I'm thinking? Only your partner can help you now. See, what the heck I'm thinking? My tech competition These fifth graders must have studied even if you didn't because that is the right answer. What the heck I'm oh. doing? What the heck I'm thinking? Oh my god. You've got $1,000. Take it in. Your classmate just bailed you out big time. You adapt in amazing ways to the climate from building tree house to keeping cool. Two on one. Uh, I thought I thought about the weather climate. Oh, uh, third grade art. Okay, the two thousand dollar question is. It is believed that pickle oh, grass are a form of prehistoric language. Yeah. Okay. I'm locking in my I'm gonna say true. The heck of it. You've got two thousand dollars. Yes, it Whoa. is. Yes, it is. It's time to pick another classmate. I'm going to go with Paul. Who is it? You've got your classmate up here with you. Pick a subject. I'm going with third grade reading. Okay. You're playing for $5,000. Under the Dewey Decimal System, which of the following topics your classmate would you find listed in. under numbers to zero to 99? Logic, linguistic, Balkany, or is oh my god, Dewey Decimal System. Four kills. I gotta use my peak. I think I'll peak. I got no idea. I got no idea. Sure yourself, huh? Well, let's see what I'm your class is. Logic. Now, yeah, locking in. Let's do it. You got $5,000. All right. Thank God. You've got your classmate up here with you. Ten, I us go with second grade measurements. $10,000 question is. Which of the following is not a... Are you kidding me? You've got $10,000. Yes. Is packed. Damn, I'm beastly. Duh. A pack is a dry measure it equals to eight fourths dry measure units. It's time to call a new classmate to the. I'm going to go with Chip. RCXD. You got your classmate up here with you. I'm going with English. Okay. This is one of the biggest questions on the board. Cool as a cucumber. That's what happens the rest of the game. Assembly. Locking in. Assembly. That is easy. Gosh. There you go. You're that is a simile. Yeah. That was pretty fast. More importantly, though, Wrong. you're right. Yes, it is. Excellent. 
excellent work. A silly face to unlike things using the words like or as, of course. Pick another subject. I'm going with... Fifth grade astronomy. Okay, no matter what happens, you've got $25,000. It's almost like a freebie question, okay, because if you get it I'm wrong, not, not the worst thing that can happen to you is you walk away with the exact yeah, amount of money nice. that you have right now. Which of the Marine series of space probes was the you first to visit Venus? Marina, 9, 2, wow. 4, or 10? I'm going to use my copy. I think I'm going to copy yeah, my classmates. The only answer I think of is 9 or 10. That's the only answer I can think of. Ten. Is it right? You're going for fifty thousand dollars. Is it right? No, I'm sorry. Either way. Oh. Either way. Wow, I was sure about that one too. That had to be nine. Up there, you see your answer. Now let's see the right one. Oh, it's two. That's right. Mariner 2 managed to send back the information oh, on shit. both Venus That's and the sun. Oh. I'm sorry, but you have flunked out of school. Yeah. I can't believe what a moron I am. All right, it is time to say those eight magic words. I am not smarter than a fifth grader. I am not smarter than a fifth grader. Goodbye, everybody. We'll see you again next time. Oh, I just had, I just had a guess, but oh well. It was kind of challenged that I thought if I could have picked math for fifty thousand dollars, I would have won that. But instead, I took the wrong one. I took the wrong answer. Oh well, twenty-five thousand dollars for this game. Short for this special game and I'll see you guys in my next segment meanwhile I have to say this I am not smarter than a fifth grader